Growing up, I always wanted to be a class officer. It felt like an honor to be nominated and elected, but I never was. And I waited and waited until finally, my last year of high school, I was nominated for a minor position. That was okay. Bumawi naman si Lord. In college, I became the president of an organization. In today's gospel, Jesus appoints Peter as, so to speak, the class president. Jesus says, You are Peter, and upon this rock, I will build my church. This comes after Peter recognizes Jesus as Christ, the Son of God. Jesus was no longer just a prophet like Elijah or Jeremiah or even John the Baptist. Instead, Peter sees Jesus as the Son of God. When Jesus makes this declaration, this is what is called as the apostolic succession or an unbroken line of succession from Peter to to the apostles, to the bishops of the Catholic Church today, of which Pope Francis is the head. Last August 6, 2023, the World Youth Day was celebrated in Lisbon, Portugal, and the CTK Youth Ministry joined the local activities with the Diocese of Cubao. During the closing and missioning Mass, Pope Francis said the following words, Dear young people, I would like to look into the eyes of each one of you and tell you, be not afraid. Be not afraid. I tell you something beautiful. It is no longer me. It is Jesus himself who is looking at you in this moment. He knows you. He knows the heart of each one of you. He knows the life of each one of you. He knows the joys, the sadness, the successes, and the failures. He knows your heart. He sees our hearts. And He tells you, on this World Youth Day, be not afraid. Take heart. Be not afraid. And if you think about it, Jesus was part of the youth when He began His ministry. And most probably, so were His apostles and followers. And even Mama Mary was part of the youth when she said her yes to God. As Christians, we are all appointed by Jesus. Maybe not as direct successors like Peter or the Apostles or even the Pope, but we are nevertheless heirs in the inheritance of Christ. But before we can partake of this inheritance, before we can enter the Kingdom of Heaven, we are reminded, especially the youth, to be not afraid. Whatever challenge, whatever problem, whatever anxiety we are feeling right now, take heart. Jesus sees us. Jesus knows our hearts. So let us take courage, keep our faith, and remember to be not afraid, to be the rock upon which Jesus builds His church. This has been Mayel for CTK Faith Streams.